it has been an absolute privilege to watch this india campaign at this t20 world cup in the usa and in the west indies i saw a major part of the 50 over world cup in october and november and i remember saying at that time that i have never seen india play more thrilling 50 overs cricket than that and i can tell you now just watching everyone play for each other just maxing the big moments at every moment finding a player to rise to the occasion this has been one of the most satisfying campaigns that uh, i have that i've watched in all these years that i've had a ringside view of of indian cricket and as this has happened through the 50 over world cup and here we've seen the evolution of a man so clear headed in his thinking so absolutely committed to playing a certain way to leading the way and saying i will bat like that come play like me and i think rohit sharma will now take his place among the great indian captains that uh, that we have had that much about rohit sharma let's move on it started really against pakistan i was in the crick bus studio that day india only 113 and they demonstrated for the first time something that they were to demonstrate right through this tournament bat first and even if you don't have enough runs on the board just field well and find the bowlers for the moment on those undercooked pitches in the usa they played three seamers then they came to the to the west indies and they found Kuldeep Yadav and the two spinners. And then when the moment came, they had Hardik Pandya bowling the final over. We saw a different Virat Kohli in this tournament. I think that he bought into the team ethics so much as if to say, right, I will show you I can bat a certain way. And in spite of not getting runs, he wasn't changing anything. And then I asked him what changed and he said, no, this was a final. And he realized that he had to adapt his game to the final and he did that thrillingly. I mean, there were people who were asking, should Virat Kohli still play? He's, he's had so many poor innings. Would you have kept someone else with such a bad run? Remember, we are talking about Virat Kohli. We are talking about someone who plays the big day almost better than anybody else. And I thought his innings today, using the nervousness of Marco Janssen and then building on that innings after the wickets had fallen was was fantastic Virat Kohli what do you say about him I was interviewing him at the end and all of a sudden this giant of a cricketer this almost angry in your face person suddenly grew soft was talking about being grateful I've done many interviews but this was uh, this was one that I will remember for a long time and then to say that is it for me in T20 internationals and the World Cup was 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 a major major call. What I enjoyed was watching youngsters grow. Arshdeep Singh grew. I know Akshar Patel is not a youngster, but every time India wanted something of Akshar Patel, he was there. Whether it was coming into bat at four or five, whether it was bowling those difficult overs to Imad Wasim in the game against Pakistan, whether it was pulling off that incredible catch on the boundary, one of the catches of the tournament, Akshar Patel was always there and he grew. Shivam Dubey played his part. Sometimes you look and say, but Hang on, Shivam Dubey is only supposed to hit sixes. Every time he came in with India having lost a wicket too many, he played a different kind of game and he showed there's a batter in him, not just, not just a slogger. Rishabh Pant in the, in the early part of, uh, of the innings, I was most satisfied seeing the evolution of Arshdeep Singh. Swung the ball beautifully at the top, came in and bowled the difficult overs when they were needed. Even here in this game, he pulled a sensational last over just when it seemed that the match could actually go away it was a fantastic over so a lot of young players like the uh, Arshdeeps and and the Dubes and the others just just grew as the uh, as, as the series wore on and that is what makes you feel that there is so much so much in the bank but believe me when I say that it was an honor absolute honor not just to be present at the ground but to call some of the actions, the action featuring Jaspreet Bumrah. I've had the great joy of seeing many great Indian bowlers. I do not think there has been a white ball Indian player anywhere close to what Jaspreet Bumrah is delivering. And I do not think there is a white ball bowler in world cricket at the moment anywhere close to Jaspreet Bumrah. Every time India wanted a wicket, 
Rohit looked at Jaspreet Bumrah. Every time India had a difficult over to bowl, Rohit looked at Jaspreet Bumrah. And you could see that great sense of calm around him. I was part of the panel that picked the player of the tournament. And believe me, it took us 5-10 seconds to make that choice because there just was no one in sight. Jaspreet Bumrah rose and rose and rose and rose. Does he have any more to rise? I don't know. Michael Vaughan, whom we hear so much on Crickbus, said, if India win this, they will become unstoppable in white ball cricket. And I'm just seeing who was not in the side. And I think these are great days ahead for uh, Indian white ball cricket. But this culture of the ensemble cast, of everyone playing together, doesn't matter if it's 23 of 10 balls, doesn't matter if it's 7 of 3 balls. Have you contributed? Have you pulled your, uh, pulled your weight? Have you done well in those little moments? That is something that, uh, that just needs to be driven home, I think, a little bit more, maybe under a new coach. And I said new coach. Did you see Rahul Dravid at the end? For a long time you didn't see him at all. And then all that class, all that dignity, all that pent up emotion erupted. I had a word with him before the game started and he was trying to play down the enormity of the moment. But here's a man who's done it for India under 19, who's done it for India A, who's now done it for the national team and is one of our greatest ever. So, Jaspreet Bumrah, Virat Kohli, Rohit Sharma, Arshdeep Singh and Rahul Dravid. Thank you for giving me a tournament to save.